Hi everyone, it's Sarah. Um, hope you've had a good couple weeks, about a week and a half maybe since I last um, posted a video. So I've decided um, to try to meet the goal of posting a one good act video three days a week. So Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I'm gonna try to use that as a schedule for a new, new video post. Um, and so today's Monday, so here's your one good act. So this comes um, from the BBC and it's in response to the um, terrible events that happened, a terrible event that happened in New Zealand um, last Friday where um, a, a person went into a mosque and um, in Christchurch, uh, New Zealand, went into a mosque and killed, I believe the death toll is now 50 people. And, um, you know, I think that's a horrible thing um, for a number of reasons, obviously, for the number of people that died. Um, but I, I do believe that um, people should not be afraid to worship or go to church or go to wherever they go to worship. Um, and those people who don't worship at all, they shouldn't be afraid to not believe. I mean, everybody has a choice. Um, in terms of their faith and what they kind of put their faith on. And so it doesn't matter if you're Muslim or Jewish or Christian um, or none of the above, um, but you certainly shouldn't be fearful of going to worship. And, you know, these people walked into their mosque that day and 49, 50 people um, are dead, All right? So it makes me really sad, but... Um, but the reason why I'm talking about it is because of one person's response. Um, and there were obviously many people's response in terms of um, posting on social media about how awful it is and, and kind of reiterating the things that I've already said. But this one guy, so his name is Andrew Greystone. Let me make sure I have that right. Andrew Greystone. And in um, his town, he's um, in Eng from England. Um, so what he ends up doing is he ends up standing outside the local mosque holding a sign and um, the sign says that he would keep watch uh, while the Muslim worshipers prayed he would keep watch for them so that they could 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 pray um, so of course this is following the terror attack that targeted two mosques in Christchurch New Zealand on Friday um, so he was standing outside um, Macedonia Mosque in Manchester and again he's holding a sign and the sign actually says you are my friends um, I will keep watch while you pray because his response to this horrible act was to you could either he, he basically says you could react to one of two ways you could react with fear which again I think people could be very afraid right or you could react with friendship and he decided to react with friendship and so he put this sign together just out of a whim and went to the mosque and stood outside. And he said at first, as um, people approached for, for the service, they were obviously hesitant, cautious, um, because initially they thought, oh, great, you know, it's probably a protester. And then as they approached and read the sign, their facial expressions changed. You know, they kind of beamed with happiness and, and smiled and, you know, nodded and... Um, were clearly appreciative of what his message was. And, um, you know, uh, let's see. Um, he runs, so Mr. Greystone runs a Christian charity. Um, and he was really surprised with the amount of um, support um, he got on social media for his act of kindness. Um, but I think at the end of the day, that's what it is, right? It's an act of kindness. Um, it's something that we all can be. We can all be kind um, to one another and respect, or at least try to respect each other's values, um, regardless of whether we believe in them or not. Um, but um, at the end of the day, this guy, rather than being really scared and fearful, he decided to just be a friend to those folks who were gonna go pray in their mosque. So that's when your one good act, it's definitely a, a one good act, it's definitely a act of kindness. And uh, I'll see you on Wednesday with a different story, bye.